guys today's topic is level to pulse converter or edge detection so we have synchronous level to pulse converter and asynchronous level to pulse converter in synchronous it is synchronous with the clock domain so let's consider a small example how it's gonna done so this is a signal and this is the level a level means nothing but a, a pulse being high for not a pulse means it's a signal being high for more than one clock period so how are we going to detect this rising edge so it's a simple uh, logic so i'm going to pass my signal through a flop which will give me a delay of one clock period and get the same signal back as you can see i got a signal delay which is exactly same but i got a one clock period delay so i'm going to complement this signal i'm going to complement signal delay and add it with the signal signal which I just passed through the flop. So I'm gonna complement it and use with the AND and then I'm gonna get the pulse. So as you can see it is 1, it is also 1 because we are seeing the complement and then ANDing it. So it's 0, it's 1 and it's 0, it's 0. So we are getting a pulse and similarly we can detect the uh, falling edge of the level. How are we gonna detect it? So first we are gonna pass through a flop then after we are going to end with the complement of the original signal so we are complementing the original signal signal over here this is the inverted signal of mm, uh, the original signal and there we are going to end it with the delayed signal so as we can see we have added this two and we are getting a pulse so how to detect a falling edge and rising edge at the same time to detect the rising edge and falling edge at the same time, we are going to use this small circuit. We are going to pass our signal and then uh, and then take the delayed signal and XOR them. As you can see, this is our signal. We are passing through it a flop. So we are getting a one clock period delay. And after getting these two signals, we are XORing it. So we are detecting this mm, rising edge and the falling edge of the level. So as you can see two pulses are being generated over here uh, when it's a rising edge we are getting a pulse when it's a falling edge we are getting a pulse so this is how we are going to detect uh, from level to uh, edge edge detection is happening and level to pulse converter is happening thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe and share it will help me a lot to produce more videos and keep on going